This is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Wednesday, December 27th. What was intended to be a Caribbean cruise followed by a return to the UK for Christmas turned into a scary situation for 225 British cruise passengers returning from a P&O cruise. Now, two and, a, uh, two and a half hours after the plane left Barbados, the turbulence resulted in an emergency landing in Bermuda and hospitalizing 11 cruise passengers. Now, for context, as part of the cruise line's fly cruise program, they charter a plane to fly from the UK to the Caribbean and then back from the Caribbean to the UK. The return flight was delayed until December 26th with passengers accommodated in Bermuda hotels and having to spend Christmas in Bermuda at the company's expense. The plane is scheduled to return to the UK later this morning. And France has found a creative way to help the homeless. The MS Bordeaux, a 256-foot cruise ship, has been repurposed as a winter shelter for the homeless. Every evening, up to 100 people have the accommodations, including single or double cabins and meals from 4.30 p.m. to 8.30 a.m. Now, since in operation in 2017, this project has increased the number of accommodations in places in Bordeaux by 36 percent, reaching over 2,000 spaces for this winter. The project is funded entirely by the state for $675,000. And the icon of the seas is gearing up for its inaugural cruise starting on January 24th from Florida. It made a stop at Navantia Shipyard in Cadiz, Spain, where it received over 10,000 plants in its Central Park area, a feature that started on the Oasis-class ships back in 2009. But the only difference is the icon will have 20% more greenery. The ship also did some technical updates and underwent some repairs while docked in Cadiz. The LNG-powered icon of the seas will home port in Miami and embark on week-long Caribbean cruises starting next month. And cruise line stocks were down on Tuesday. Carnival Corporation down 1.6%, 18.32. Royal Caribbean down slightly, 128.40. And Norwegian down a half percent, 20.21. If you have a lead on the story, drop us a line, tips at cruiseradio.net. Have yourself a great Wednesday. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today.